Today we're going to be talking about disk bound planning. So if you're new to planners or you just want a little bit more information, this is going to be a great video for you. We're going to talk about some of my expert tips on how to get the most out of your planner and maybe you'll learn some things that will help make your planner more effective. Hi, I'm Jane. I'm the CEO and founder of janesagenda.com and for the last 10 years we've been helping women make planners that actually work. Today we're going to be talking about what a disk bound planner is and I'm going to be giving you some expert tips on how to get the most out of your disk bound planner. What is disk bound? Disk bound is a completely interchangeable, customizable planner system that utilizes disks as binding. Why would someone choose a disk bound planner? It's completely customizable, the pages can be flipped 360 degrees, and you can personalize it any way you like. All right, so now let's start talking about all the specifics of disk bound planning. All right, so these are disk bound binding disks. They come in different sizes, colors, materials. Not all disks are created equally, so different brands might make them a little different. These are Jane's Agenda disks. We had these made specifically for us, for our size and our type and our quality. These ones are two inch disks, but we sell disks that go all the way down to three quarters inch. So when you look at the disks on a disk bound planner, you'll see that they're not actually attached. You can spin the disks 360 degrees. That's because of the way that the pages are punched to fit on the disks. And I'll show you that in a second. Um, so what's important to know about disks is the size of the disk. See here I have one and a half inch and a two inch disk. There we go. The size of the disk will tell you how much you can put on your planner. So a larger disk will hold more pages and more planner items than a smaller disk. Here I have a one inch disc next to a one and a half inch disc and you can see the size of the thickness of the planner varies greatly. So if you want a really big, thick, chunky planner, you're going to want a two inch disc like this one. The first thing that we're going to talk about is the different sizes of disc bounds. So there are a wide variety of mini disc bound sizes that are available out there. We offer four different sizes at janesagenda.com. We offer mini, junior, classic, and letter. And so I'm going to stack them now so you can see a size comparison. Letter size features 11 discs and, and the pages measure 8.5 by 11 inches. And then we have classic size. Classic size takes nine discs and the pages measure seven by 9.25 inches. Then we have Junior. Junior takes eight discs and the pages measure five and a half inches by eight and a half inches. And Mini. Mini has seven discs and the pages are 4.6 inches by seven inches. Now we're gonna talk about the different pieces of a disc bound planner. So we already covered what discs are this is a planner cover. They come in a wide variety of options. This particular one is a laminated planner cover and we use a vellum paper so that it's transparent. That way you can create layers in your planner. You're going to want different pieces that fit the exact planner size that you, you choose. So if you pick a classic size, you want to make sure that you only buy classic size planner items to go in your planner. This planner right here is a junior size. This item is called a cardstock dashboard. It's mostly used for decorative purposes, again, to create pretty layers in your planner. Um, but you can also use them to hold sticky notes to mark different sections in your planner. They have lots of different purposes. If you want more information about how to use dashboards, we have a helpful blog post at janesagenda.com that goes over all the details about how you can use dashboards effectively. This item here is a divider. We sell several different types of dividers. This one is a cardstock divider with a mylar tab um, area on here. We also sell plastic dividers that are more durable. Um, and so again, that just comes down to your preference, what you like in your planner, what kind of layers you want. Um, and so these are dividers. This particular item is an insert. They are punched pages that go in your planner. You can get them with calendars, with note pages, tasks, um, pretty much anything you can think of. There's probably a planner insert out there that can cover it. We offer a huge selection at janesagenda.com, um, and you want to pick those to fit whatever lifestyle you have. This particular item is a planner page finder. You use it to mark your spot in your planner, and that way you can find where you're looking. 
our planner page finders are all the same size, so it doesn't matter what size your planner is, you just want to pick what punch style. And then we design them to stick out the top of your pages so that you can find them. Okay, so let's quickly go over how to put new items on your disc bound planner. You'll notice the punch shape here, this mushroom shaped punch, this is what's going to hold your items to your discs. When you're putting something on your planner, you're just going to carefully push around each disc and that's going to help you assemble your pages without hurting anything. Uh, we're going to go ahead and put a cover on, same thing. You'll notice just one at a time, push on both sides of the disc and you can easily put items on. When you're ready to take items off, all you're going to do is pull from the top down, one at a time, letting it come off the discs. Real easy, and if you're careful, you can reuse your planner items many, many times. Same thing, you'll see they just kind of come right off. No problem. Common questions we get about disc-bound planning is will the discs fall out? Because they're not actually secured to your pages, this is a very uh, common question that we get. No, the discs won't fall out. Because there's so much attached to them, those discs are secure until you, until you try to remove them, which you're going to take pieces off one at a time to do that. Um, these discs aren't going anywhere. They're very secure. Another question we get is how do you write with the discs if you're left-handed? Because the discs will get in the way. Uh, if the discs get in your way at all, what's really nice about disc-bound planning is all you have to do is flip your planner over. And then the discs lay nice and flat against your planner pages and giving you this nice big surface to write. And that works for both ways. So whether you're writing on the left page or the right page, you can do the same thing. Um, very versatile. We have a helpful blog post that goes over the same information in more detail. You can also shop from our collection. We offer a wide variety of planner items. If you found this video useful, I hope that you like this video, comment, tell us what you liked about it, and subscribe to our channel. Tap the bell icon so you get notified every time we share helpful planner information. Smile, and then we look at the camera. We have a lot of that.